So I don't know if you guys know, but on most recent iOS devices, you are able to identify songs directly from your control center and then play them on Apple Music. But what if you're not an aspiring Apple sheep and you already pay for a better streaming service such as YouTube or even Spotify? Well, do I have a shortcut for you. So in this video, I will show you how to create a shortcut that will identify a song and then play it on YouTube. So on a high level, what we're trying to create is an action that will identify the song. Once you identify the song, you can then search for that song on Google but with your streaming service of choice. From the list of all the search results, you pull the result that contains your streaming service URL and then you modify that link and open it in your streaming service. So that's how it looks from the high level. Let's go deep into how the shortcut actually works. You first have the Shazam it action. This will listen to the music around you or the music your phone is playing and try to identify that song. Then we have a URL encode action that takes the name of the song and encodes it to look like a URL. And then you can search for a YouTube link for that song with a simple Google search query through a URL action. The results from this action are then pulled and fed into a repeat action where you look for that YouTube URL. Once you have the link to your song on YouTube, you can split that link to get the YouTube video ID. And then you can use it to create a new YouTube link that starts with music.youtube.com. We do that because this kind of URL or this kind of link will open in the YouTube music app instead of Safari or the default music app. At which point this will just start playing the song and you can stop the shortcut. I also have a Spotify version of this shortcut. If you don't care about creating the shortcut and you just want easy access to these shortcuts, there are download links to each one of them in the description below. And that's all I have for you today. Thank you everybody for watching. This is Geek.